Hey guys, how's it going? It is I, the real Randy Chavez. I'm coming at you with a Halloween. Well, happy Halloween. It's kind of a scary video. Is it just, um, <laughs> I guess, the, keeping it in the spirit of things, really scary story. For me, anyway, um, it was 2013. It was like May of that year, I think. I was at, um, this is in the location right out, uh, right outside of McGuire Air Force Base. McGuire Air Force Base, out the main gate. If you go straight for like three miles, there's a Wawa or like a mile, you know, something like that, two miles, something. And the Wawa, for those of you that don't know, is kind of like a combination between a 7-Eleven and a Subway. Like convenience store, but they make sandwiches there. So um, all I just had on me, you know, as, and I was like, all right, let me just let me just go for a run. You know, I didn't want to just, I've been running on the track, um, you know, at that time. I was just, right, I was in, I was in decent shape. Again, military, I just got on base. And I was like, all right, let me run to Wawa. So all I had on me was my ID to get back on base and like five bucks for a muscle milk. So I was going to go run to Wawa, drink the muscle milk, and then run back. So uh, as I'm running, and it's just straight away, run outside the gate, and there is this deer that I hit. In New Jersey, there's lots of deer. So right outside the gate, anyone that was stationed there or knows that road just knows there's a whole bunch of woods. Uh, on the right hand side and deer are there and unfortunately one got hit and I don't I think it was fresh because it was like there's no flies around but nothing had been in like inside of it or anything there was nothing um there was all still there so I'm just like oh all right that's a little weird and uh, like uh, you know whatever it's like the first one that I've seen like roadkill like up close the first like oh all right so I go I run you know, maybe like uh, 20 minutes later, whatever, I'm on my way back and I'm on the other side of the road and it's getting, um, it's, it's nighttime now. It was like kind of dusk, it was dusk when I was running and now it's like, okay, nighttime. Um, and I, two lanes of traffic going one way, two lanes of traffic going the other. And on my way back, I th thought it was a homeless man. And... I, I see like someone like going in at the deer and I was like, what the fuck? Like, again, I'm new as a bear. Was it like a hairless bear? Cause it was, it was big, uh, but they had like no clothes, no hair. I was like, what the fudge? Um, and I'm like, I'm running and I'm like slowing down and I, it doesn't like pay attention to me at all. Um, there's no cars on there on the road at this point. Um, and then, as I come to a stop and, you know, there's a little bit of gravel underneath my sneakers, like, you know, made that sound. And then as soon as I stopped, I heard like a banshee scream, like, I, I can't replicate it, like, like, and then it fucking took off. It was like, have everyone seen uh, Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace, where uh, Qui-Gon Jinn, Obi-Wan are um, fighting those destroyers, like, it's a standoff, let's go. And they use the force to like run really, really quickly. That's almost what it was like. It was, what the fuck? So I was like, <laughs> I was like, I don't know what to do. So no cars coming up. I go over and I see like half of this deer is like destroyed. Um, and I was like, that wasn't a bear, but it like, what the actual fuck was that? Because half this deer is like gone. And I was like, this was a full deer. Like, like 20 minutes ago, full deer. And now like, maybe there's more of them. I don't like... Whatever the fudge it was, I was like, okay, um, I need to go. And <laughs> so I go and I, I I run back to base and I'm like, every once in a while looking over my shoulder, I was like, it's going to come back for me. It's like going to protect its kill. And I'm like unarmed. I have nothing. Like <laughs> I have, the, I have like my little fiery fist of fury that is not going to stop what ate half of like this 200 pound deer in 20 minutes so i was like all right so i go back to base and um you know i'm a little tired because i you know i was around like however many miles and um the uh one of the gate uh gate guards um security forces guards the base so they and they check anyone's ids that come in and and they're armed they're pretty well armed i mean not well armed you know like nine millimeters so it's anyway um 
they go and uh, I was like, oh, where are you coming from? I was like, oh, I'm just coming from Wawa. And it's just like, oh, okay, you like you ran? I was like, yeah, yeah, just get some exercise. And, and then I asked him, like, okay, is there like, you know, I'm pretty new to this base. Is there any like wildlife around here? And they're like, oh, you know, like there's deers and stuff. There's, and there's deers on base too. I was like, oh yeah, I've, I've seen the deer on base. I was like, but what eats the deers? And they're like, well, um, nothing. There's like, uh, I mean, they, they, they can get hunted, um, but like there wasn't really any bears where we were. There was some bobcats where we were, but they're like 30 pounds. They're not going to hunt these things, I don't think. Um, and bobcat story is a story for another time. So we go and I was like, listen, I, I, I just ran all the way to Wawa and I explained to them exactly what I saw. And they're just like, I don't know, but you know, that's, that's completely out. Like, that's not our jurisdiction. That is outside the base. We're about what's inside the base. And I was like, I kind of want to go back. And I was like, you probably shouldn't do that. And I was like, okay, you know what? You're, you're right. I probably shouldn't. Um, and I go and I do some searching on the interwebs and the closest thing I'm thinking, like trying to describe it, I was like, you know, it was like a naked bear. Like I think it was like a bear maybe with like a uh, mange and it lost all its hair and I'm trying to describe it and like, I'm not finding anything. So uh, I go to my friend Phillips and he's just like, type in New Jersey devil. And I was like, what? Cause I'm not from New Jersey. I wasn't, uh, and it was like, and I was like, and it was relatively similar to what I, it didn't have wings or anything, or I don't, I don't, I don't fucking know. Again, it was dark, and I around us there, there's no bears. There's no bear sight. I was there for like three and a half years. There's no bear sightings there, and I was very, very distraught. And like maybe homeless man, homeless men that like camped out in those woods, and like they found this deer, and they started carving it up or whatever but no it didn't look like clean it wasn't surgical like the, the cuts on them weren't it was like someone went at it maybe you could make the argument okay they had serrated blades and they but it was i i couldn't remains a mystery anyway guys that's my halloween video i have lots to do tonight so i would love you all but please comment like and subscribe comment your halloween story your scary story that you're just like freaked out about. It never got solved. Let me know. Chavez loves you. Peace.